Hello. I see her. Terraria. The last part, we got the hard mode. On our moderately impromptu wall of flesh fight. <laughs> so that was something. Alright, I have a warrior emblem. My uh, Shield of Cthulhu dash will deal more damage. Thinking I probably want to acquire spider stuff. Although it is raining, maybe I should try for a Nimbus Rod right now. I don't know, I'm trying to, I've been trying to think of like eye weapons that I haven't already killed the mech bosses with. I've already used a Dark Pistol. I've already like used Nimbus Rod. I don't remember if I've ever done a summoner kill on a mech boss. So the spiders are somewhat attractive. Oh right, I'm too close to NPCs. What am I doing? Not spawning Nimbuses. Um, yeah, Spirit Flame, the mage weapon from the desert, which requires, I think, like, multiple sand elemental kills. I haven't done that one. Ever. Don't think I've even had one, let alone killed a boss with it. Hmm, my pre-hard mode weapons are amazingly ineffective. Still, I can fight them. Well, it's raining. Might be a good thing to do. Did make plenty of wooden arrows for this bow that transforms wooden arrows. I guess the thing is, I could make it rain again at any time. It's journey mode. So let's actually like go down. Yeah, there's not a sandstorm. I guess, yeah, it's raining. It's not windy. <laughs> Why would there be a sandstorm? Wait, didn't I? I thought I summoned imps, but I apparently just touched the summon thing and then left. Um, there it is. See, Breaker Blade doesn't have eye in it. I was gonna be like, oh yeah, I should be using my weapon from Wall of Flesh. Especially because I got the melee emblem, but no, that's, that's not allowed. Trying to acquire the spider weapons would definitely be more reliable than trying to farm the Nimbus Rod right away. I know, I'm going back and forth on what I want to do, but I'm already out here fighting Nimbuses. <laughs> It's like a 1 in 15. I think I've actually like misquoted it as 1 in 22 before. Or maybe they patched it. I, I was looking at possible weapons earlier this week. Actually, no matter which world evil I had, the, um, the dart weapon would still have an eye in it from the mimics. Because it's either dart rifle or dart pistol. I thought one of them was called dart gun. Hmm, I might still be too close to NPCs up here. I'm not seeing a ton of enemies. 
Do we head over into the evil biome? <laughs> Actually, I need to farm surface hallow still. Get some pixie dust. Should find where that ended up. Or do we know? No, I don't think we know yet. Because, like, I defeated Wall of Flesh and then, like, immediately the stream was over, pretty much. Best chance of a Nimbus is probably around here. No NPCs, no extra enemies from the biome. Oh, but there's... Maybe the guide's too close. I don't know. I mean, it's pretty far away. I really don't know at what range NPCs affect spawn rate. Because usually I'm either very far from NPCs or I'm very close to them. Like, on screen, very close. Man, those imps went nuts there. So I haven't found either extra crimson or extra hallow in this direction. I wonder if the crimson part of the V hit the existing crimson biome. Looking very likely at this point. Oh hey, Nimbus. I wonder if it's even worth deploying that. Oh yeah, ones of damage. That'll show him. Oh, I was gonna say, and that's with a shark tooth necklace, but it isn't. So uh, let's not say that. All right, let's explore the other half of the world. <laughs> I also just apparently randomly have a health forge. I guess, yeah, I was digging out. Uh, what am I doing? Okay. Maybe we should be dealing with or dealing things... Ah! Either doing things with or dealing with plants. <laughs> Not both of them. You can't mix the sentences that well. Hmm, should I be breaking altars right now? I kind of went over that whole crimson biome. I mean, it is raining right now. Okay, here's the hallow. We found it. Yeah, turns out I deal no damage. So we hallowed some of the snow biome. Just a little. And also there's a storm right now. So let's head back to the desert. I guess it did get windy, or... Hmm, maybe rain can just look like that. Don't know all my weather effects. Oh, there's no pile on there. I was like, oh yeah, we can just warp back to the... No, we can't. I think I am just gonna go for the spiders, though. At all this time, I'm like, yeah, sure would be cool if I could deal damage to things. So let's go for a weapon that we can reliably get. Well, 
you know, as much as our ability to actually kill the enemies is reliable. So what is the plan for killing spiders here? The on fire debuff, I guess. That's the plan. Did that spider die? Or did it despawn because I went down too fast? Lava. I feel like exactly the right height. <laughs> um, at least I think it is. Mm, they don't seem to actually hit it very reliably, though. Oh, uh. The bats. I was watching the spiders. Huh? Oh, right. Spiders have a web projectile. I wonder... I don't know if spider fangs get melted by lava. So let's put platforms over this. If I'm gonna be coming this way a lot. Oh, right. Uh... So wait, we're close to the hallow here. So I guess we're also trying to farm souls of light. gone to the right spot yet. So yeah, I just wanted to dig through here. Place a bit more of a wall here. There's no background walls. So the spiders won't be able to climb over if they spawn in here. Maybe also can make like a staircase in this direction a bit. I mean, yeah, they'll, they'll jump that. Don't need to make it staircase the whole way up. Send a bit taller. Place some actual torches. Then if I get in here, stuff's gonna spawn barely off camera to the left. And not actually very much in here. Seems it actually spawns below me. Could try to remove other spawn points. Oh hey, a soul of light up there. Something died in that direction. Oh, spider's trying to crawl through the lava over here. I think my piggy bank still has an obsidian skin potion for if I do need to dive into lava to get some loot. Black Recluse did get trapped. This might be the most convenient spider biome near lava I've ever had. 
Okay, they do spend a little time on the left not bathing in lava. Maybe I can remove a couple blocks there. Fight some hallow. Oh, hey, there's the stylist. Just noticed. Oh, uh, bye, stylist. I guess that's good for my spawn rates. Wait. We just got a. Poison staff, which there's an iron poison. Don't kill me, I want the loot. So that could be a mage weapon. <laughs> Bad modifier, but. Might be more worthwhile on the bar than the shovel right now. I'm getting a little destroyed here. <laughs> Ones of damage. Didn't really have a plan for if a spider actually ended up in the spider biome. Might have, you know, been something that would have been good to think about. I'm really worried they're just gonna suddenly shoot a web and then I'm like dead. I guess, I don't know if the web projectile itself deals damage, or if the problem is just that you get webbed. Well, that went well. Ten fangs. Could try a mage build with the poison staff. In which case, I'd just want to start getting working on hard mode ores. Because that would be my armor set for the mage. I don't have any mage accessories, though. Which would make trying such a build a little awkward. if they really are just gonna stay there and get stuck without even attacking. I wonder if they can shoot while they're climbing on the wall or if they need to be in their ground form. I think they can actually. Yeah, it is hard to shoot the Hellwing bow upward due to the random scattering. let that one die just over there I think or, no I can probably just break this and run away okay and then while that's dying over there shoot these with some magic
Got my magic back a lit little. Okay, that does deal damage, but it's only 40. We did finally get shot, though. Ow. Hmm. There's suddenly a lot more shooty. Mystic Poison Staff. That sounds better. Seven spider fangs. I think I can make the summon weapon. Oh, actually, do I need a. No, I don't need a hard mode anvil yet. Seven souls. All right. So I guess I didn't look at if I could make anything else with my... Okay, I could make the headgear. Which does have the minion slot on it. Actually, this set probably gives two minion slots. the wrong chest. If I say things like that occasionally, people will think there's actually a system to the organization. Um, I mean, Necro Armor I could pretty much just trash. But I like holding on to my past equipment that I actually used for some reason. So that's what we're doing. Yeah, back to the spiders again. No, oh, I didn't actually summon my headgear slots minion. Oh, hey, a wizard. Uh, is there anything I immediately want to buy from him? Crystal ball could be good. I guess if I'm shooting a mystic poison staff, I even want to set it down and buff up. That a, that's a ruby bunny. Okay. I was like, is there somehow a corrupt bunny down here? <laughs> um. Stylist has arrived. the ghost from the tombstone. Because I haven't done a difficulty verification yet. Oh no, the wizard. eventually want like the bell hmm. 
I guess if I'm up here, there are more places down there for spiders to appear. Also probably more possibility of a despawn if I move around while fighting other enemies. I do like to occasionally check my loot. Oh, the wizard arrived. Oh, my flight ran out at an awkward spot. Nope. Oh. <laughs> right, I've only got fledgling wings. <laughs> Maybe you should keep that in mind. But I probably have enough fangs for another piece of the armor. Let's see, uh, oh, every piece of the armor has a minion slot on it. I see. I'll need a few more fangs to complete the set. Gamma correction, yeah. <laughs> I always notice my stream preview looks a little dark. Or not always, but last time I did. Hmm. Not sure where I put gem bunnies. All right, I died, so all my spiders are despawned. the mechanic. Also, shouldn't I be moving this pair to the ice biome? Just making sure the mechanic's not busy keeping a pylon open that I might want to warp to. Can't find him. here. Ah. Squirrels don't sell for very much. Today seems perfect. Nice. We've been close enough to the hallow for hallow enemies and things, so I was like, is that gonna be a crystal shard? But I guess it would have to actually hallow the rock first. And I haven't even seen where the hallow actually is. Okay, there were spider fangs in the lava. That's what I wanted to know. Hellfire. I am allowed to use that. Don't think I will, but it's allowed. Should have checked how many fangs I need for the pants. There's an eye in fire. Now 
And if its name was like Red Yo-Yo, I wouldn't be able to al uh, allowed to use it. I can only use weapons if they have an eye in them. Okay, yeah, I, I, I see where the confusion could come from. That's probably enough fangs, right? Didn't actually drop the thing in that slot before I closed the inventory. Okay, yeah, I got way more than I needed. I guess I probably want to make the sentry too, though. Sometimes I clo the, close the inventory and then realize I shouldn't have. Okay, set bonus is 12% minion damage. Okay. So now that we're capable of doing battle with our spider army... I think I'd rather go for wings than bother to get the sentry right now. Right, I don't have a sky bridge at all. I just kind of used gravitation potions. Alright, let's make this wide enough to put a sharpening station on and then start roping upward. Oh, the truffle arrived. Neat. Oh, that's where the mechanic was. I skipped over it, I guess. I guess once I have souls of flight, what am I gonna actually make the wings out of? Okay, harpies are spawning. This must be high enough. Out of step stools. <laughs> the step stool wings. I mean, I haven't visited the wings page on the wiki in a while. Maybe they added it without patching the game. Somehow. This is probably enough platform. Let's get a campfire down. Uh, background walls might be neat, considering I'm using spiders. But I, th I think the wyvern tends to come through the platform enough as it face er, chases the player. Petition for Redigit to add step stool wings into Terraria. Okay, also this spiders can jump. Didn't quite realize how much jump height they had. Unfortunately, you had to encounter a real-life spider the other day, and their jump power is scary? I see. <laughs> he almost hit me. My summons did anything there. Maybe wyverns move too fast. 19 souls of flight, huh? Close call, yeah. 
Me and my 33 defense might not have taken the hit so well. Would be really convenient if one of these harpies just wanted to drop the giant feather for the harpy wings. Oh. Yeah, I guess I am getting some spider damage as it moves through the area. Ow. Oh, I'm out of magic. Oh, I don't have a mount yet. I wanted to fast fall. All right, well, I have souls of flight. Could go for pixie wings. Could show the souls of flight to the guide and actually decide from there. Could research them. Guide is down at the cavern pylon. Thought that was the case. No, wait, you're the. I was incorrect about it being the case. Where's the guy? Oh. Hmm. Well, I know where the guide's going to be. <laughs> Do I want to get some fireflies? Yeah, somehow mixed up the head sprites of the guide and the arms dealer. <laughs> hmm. I'm suddenly regretting not building this house in the sky. Or rather, like, slightly elevated. Soul of flight in a bottle. Angel wings. Demon wings. Pixie wings, harpy wings. Yeah, just a giant harpy feather. Butterfly dust. <laughs> Do we go to the forest right now? Or er, not, not forest, jungle? I'm not sure where the fire and ice feathers even come from. These are way ahead of where we have access to. I guess they're both males. Oh, the the guide and the arms dealer, yeah. I think pixie dust would be the easiest to acquire. But I'm realizing if I'm doing summoner things, I really should have killed Queen Bee. <laughs> you know, before putting the world into Hard mode. <laughs> Let's see if we can just go down and do it. Without, you know, getting murdered by hard mode jungle enemies. I mean, if we can get in the hive and seal it off so no, no normal enemies approach, I think we're at least well equipped for the boss fight. I really just emptied that chest and didn't take it.
Did I do the same here? Man, I'm bad at Terraria. So I thought I at least like knew where a hive was. That may not be the case. Is that Is that the temple? I mean it looks like it. I see the golem thing. There was a trap there, by the way. Oh, I guess I'm actually like pretty far down considering this is only a medium world. For a second I was thinking like, <laughs> this was a really close to the surface temple. Oh right, there's still a trap there, by the way. Acknowledging a trap doesn't remove it from the game. bother looting that. It had a flare gun. <laughs> Therefore, the entire chest is tainted, apparently. It really wasn't a hive already on my map. It was the jungle temple. Uh, hmm. Right, I need to get to the underground hallow at some point to upgrade my potions. Finding so many life crystals. May not even feel like duplicating heart lanterns this playthrough, just use my incredible number of life crystals. So we're in hard mode. We're looking for a hive. This is cool and normal. Every, everybody plays Terraria like this. The rest of the stuff can just stay in there. Yeah, can't you like... No. Why would I think that would do anything? I tried right-clicking him. You can summon them directly on him. I think I might have mixed things up with Calamity Mod. But even then, I think I'd have to put it on my bar first. I haven't played Calamity Mod in, like, months. Why would I still be mixing things up with that? I guess maybe because it's like the only time I've done summoner things, really. <laughs> ow, ow, ow. Okay, so the jungle ends over there. There's a Medusa. I guess I looked away just in time. Never watched a Calamity playthrough? Maybe I should try one on camera sometime. I never finished my old old playthrough. Um, there was a bug with a boss spawning, and it did get fixed, but I was it was also like a multiplayer playthrough, and the other person didn't feel like continuing it anymore. Hmm, I sure don't have a lot of health. It's almost like the hard mode jungle's dangerous or something. Like, whose idea was it to come here? Ow! I died to the bees that come out of the blocks. <laughs> yeah, with Tmod Loader near 1.4, though, I feel like I want to see if Calamity updates to 1.4. 
It would also be fun to see me die, in addition to be it being fun for to see a Calamity playthrough. Makes sense. I would die plenty in Calamity. That mode is hard. And I would probably insist on playing in Revengeance mode. Because that feels like the main mode, for some reason. Oh yeah, I don't need these spider fangs with me. They can go in here, though. Um... Wait, these moon glow seeds didn't... Oh, yeah. You've heard it's difficult? Yeah. Yeah, adds a ton of new bosses, modifies all the existing bosses. I want... Oh wait, I can just hit the map. I don't need to actually right-click the pylon. Alright. Let's try to get to that hive with more hit points. At least I know a hive, yeah. Oh, didn't see that whatever I just landed directly on. close to it, right? I guess there'll be a big X on my map, actually. Because <laughs> of the death. Oh yeah, there it is. I don't know, maybe I got shot by something instead of actually dying to the tiny bees. Oh! Yeah, we probably don't want that poking through the floor as we're fighting. Let's just actually just start the fight here. Sure don't have a lot of space. Might have wanted to dig out a little of the ceiling. Also, getting a whip might have been good. You know, summoner things. Okay, we won, the witch doctor can spawn. That was our entire goal in the jungle. <laughs> yeah, just toss these in research, why not? can go here. Alright, so whips. What whips exist? Probably want one that has summon tag damage, since I'm using spiders that get a lot of hits. I know there's that, like, frost whip, but I don't think it's actually what we want. Oh yeah, also the wing project. Haven't haven't finished that. Maybe get back to that while we wait for the witch doctor to spawn. Oh, uh, there's the witch doctor. Oh, like literally in front of me. Okay. Oh, but you may need to be in the jungle to sell literally anything I'm interested in. I could buy the leaf wings, yeah, but they're not very good wings ever since 1.4. 
I'm gonna insist on wings that are at least as good as pixie wings. All right, it may need to be night for the witch doctor to sell what I want him to sell, but I'm also just gonna move him in here in case it needs to be jungle. But I'm pretty sure he sells the like plus one minions accessory. Oh uh, yeah. Or wait. Oh, near the current pylon, right, because I moved the painter out. Anyway, let's get the, uh... The goblin and the... Not goblin, uh, mechanic. Moved into the ice biome. And finally get that pylon. I wonder if this is proper ice biome or if it's hallowed. That might affect my ability to actually get the pylon. Does Ice Hello have a music? I I don't know the game music. Sounded like normal ice music, but you don't know if Ice Hello has its own music. Okay. We need a hundred of this, or I could just research it. <laughs> Nah, we'll, we'll actually farm all the way. No, oh, I probably have ice can- or not ice candles, water candles in my piggy bank? Yeah. gnome friends. Uh, I'm not sure. Could also get a blood moon going for more spawns. Yeah, I don't know if I want that many spawns. A duck. And battle potion, yeah. Could also... <laughs> uh, just set this to X10. <laughs> uh, quack, yeah. Not the same duck that was there a moment ago. I'm pretty sure. I don't know if the gnome would actually do anything, since I think getting some amount of pixie drop is like, or pixie dust is like an 100% drop, maybe? It is interesting that I'm getting some critters. I don't know, maybe luck affects item quantities, too. I don't know all the effects of luck, besides it has, like, a small impact on drop rates and a small impact on crit chance. Oh! I was wondering why I was getting critters. It's because the demolitionist is moving to his house. I'm gonna make it night. and then try to get people to warp. I 
I guess I can check on the ice pylon then. So I should really make a grand design sometime. Hello, lanterns? Yeah. Oh yeah, we beat <laughs> the queen bee. <laughs> Can farm pixie dust on a lantern night. Actually have a reason to be on the surface in a lantern night. Hmm. Although I seem to be getting a lot of enemies that are not pixies. Eh, whatever. Might want some torches if I'm gonna be hanging out here. Lantern night not a good enough reason for being on the surface? It's it's not. Alright. If I wanted to just research the pixie dust, we could be done with pixie dust forever now. Mind getting a unicorn mount or like a couple unicorn horns though? I don't have a mount at all. And the unicorn does have pretty good run speed, if I recall. Yeah. <laughs> Queen bee in hard mode, it's certainly a funny reason for a lantern night. Ow. Keep forgetting I don't have, like, actual wings. Thought I could hover above the unicorn for longer than that. Okay, so wings, a whip... And then do we, like, get challenging? Oh, wait, I need souls so I can actually make the boss items. <laughs> also, getting a summoner emblem might be neat. You know, if we're gonna summon. Oh yeah, and the better potions. Early hard mode potions. Wonder if I'm gonna fight a boss this stream. I haven't broken an altar yet, so they can't even summon themselves. Oh, actually, yeah, don't I need the hard mode anvil too? Do a Crimson Mimic for better potions, yeah? I think crafting them is way easier. Oh, there was a Wraith sitting on me. Is Queen Bee not boss enough? You're right, I did fight a boss this stream. Don't need Anvil for boss? Okay. Yeah, I haven't broken an altar yet. I don't know if you came in in time for me to say that. Hello, yeah. The objective right now is pixie wings. All right, I should check in with the witch doctor while it's night, actually. See if he sells anything new. Let's see. Yeah, the pygmy necklace. I wanted one of these. Leaf wings are expensive. I could get it, but that's not the plan. They're not as good. All right. I 
should maybe put a campfire down. Whip, souls, potions. I guess at this stage in the game, I'd even want like summoning potions, not just the better health potions. See, so, yeah, I didn't actually get the sentry yet. There are just so many things that you want in an early hard mode. Didn't want to keep farming spider fangs. I keep not seeing the wraiths. Maybe I should make it daytime again, but like lantern night. To 47 dust. I guess before I get farming souls, maybe I should break some altars just so that if I see the ore, I can grab it. <laughs> you thought I only had like 30? Yeah, I mean, Pixie does drops pretty reliably. As long as you're reliably fighting Pixies. Man, I might want to turn on Biome Spread just to get this Hallow a little wider. This Hallow's tiny. <laughs> How many Flight Souls do I have? 29, I think. The first wyvern dropped to 19, and I was like super sad for like a tenth of a second. And then I killed another wyvern. I guess I might actually need some of these lenses for the twin summon. I feel like I'm always surprised by how few lenses I have at this stage in the game. You're sad I'm not picking up the stars on the right? I didn't see the stars on the right. I'll even get this mana star to the left. <laughs> Yay! That was another four pixie dust. Another three. Still haven't worked out what whip to try to acquire. I can probably already make, like, Spinal Tap or something. Why is there a duck? Also Quack, yes. I know, we should kill Empress of Light to get that whip. The obvious choice next. Actually, don't you have to, like, kill Plantera or something before the Lace Wings spawn? <laughs> Water? Oh, I thought you needed NPCs for any kind of critter. Nope. 
Fight Wall of Flesh again for Whip? Yeah, there is one, isn't there? And I do want an emblem that's not a warrior emblem. Oh, actually, what am I doing? Just put the pygmy necklace there. <laughs> Honestly, I'm not gonna use the Ice Blade. You always support Wall of Flesh fights, I see. Let's get our wings first. Oh wait, there's a hallowed key over there. <laughs> okay. Hallowed key before blessed apple, sure. Wondering if there's anything underground I need to de despawn, so I just flew as high as I could. Which isn't very high, that's why we're trying to get wings. Enjoying the duck quacks, nice. Double duck. still have the bone glove equipped. I think it's feeling a little outdated at this point, although it is nice for Wall of Flesh. I guess I'm about to fight Wall of Flesh. Cute idea, swimming in Hollow Lake and watching guys here fight pixels, <laughs> or pixies together, not pixels. Oh, it's a duck couple idea, I see, yes. Just need four more dust. Okay, you wanna drop all of it? No, you wanna drop one of it. Pixie banner, just as I get the dust. That's funny. Uh, so yeah, souls. Wait a minute. I need the anvil for this. <laughs> well. I needed the materials too, it's not like I wasted my time. <laughs> Man, I'm bad at Terraria. Second time today I've been bad at Terraria. Hello! Island loot. This is a miscellaneous chest. You have plans to watch anime with friends, so you'll catch me later. Don't forget the impromptu wall of flesh. Your no fishing, no bosses start hard mode run made you appreciate how little you can do without the mithril anvil. Okay. Uh, that's not what this run's about, though. <laughs> but yeah. I watched some like highlights of a no E run, which also really delays the anvil. Um, right, do I have, yeah, I do have voodoo dolls researched.
Wait, let's let's break altars. <laughs> Cause we want that anvil. Uh, fishing could get crates, which could get hard mode metals. Palladium, mithril, adamantite. Oh, I didn't save an altar in a good spot for crafting. So there's no altars over there. Come on, I just want to break one more altar. Without dying. I guess I'll just dig to this one. Didn't think I'd have to dig. Knew it was gonna be slow still. Alright. Altar number six. I do wonder if I can just start the fight and win it without any further anything. No, maybe I should have at least like looked into whether I could make spinal tap. Ow. Sir, uh, jumping in the lava was not a good start. I need the spiders to get over to the main boss because it, I could just summon them directly there. I got too far away. Oh no. <laughs> All right, didn't win. <laughs> it was kind of close though. Helen would be proud. I did in fact die, yeah. To wall of flesh. Without sufficient wall of flesh preparations. Alright. So, maybe I need to like, prepare any amount of pathway. Uh, that might help. Also, like, potions, you know. There are, like, at least, like, ten ways I could have been more prepared that I just decided not to do. <laughs> Obsidian skin and water walking may be fine. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Actually, summoning my summons would help. I guess, how much of those do I have? Um, there are two water walkings in here. I'm gonna regen potion out. Yeah, iron skin. Ah, there's obsidian skin. Yeah, I mean, that's probably enough, honestly. If I just didn't dip in the lava once and take, like, 100 damage or whatever, I think that would've just won the fight.
that place that I had to dig through last time. Okay, got him. I'm just gonna research the treasure bags. Oh, did I not hit the lava with that? Oh, wait, where'd the, where'd the... Oh, the guide hasn't respawned. Of course. Yeah. I was thinking it would be nice to fight another while the buffs were going. Is it... It's daytime. Yeah, I figured he'd spawn the other way. I was thinking of that. Okay, so we have a guide again. Buffs are still going. Oh, those are bombs! <laughs> I mis-selected my <laughs> spider staff. Did not intend to use a bomb as a weapon. They don't have eye in them. But I'll, I'll let it slide this time. All right, we're apparently just shooting him with crossbones at that point. All right, if one more guide wants to spawn in the next eight minutes, well, I guess four minutes. That would be neat. Oh hey, it's Soul of Light. <laughs> For free. Checking to see if I missed the guide notification. Oh, hey. I could use some crystal shards. Well, we're waiting for exactly that. I don't actually know which way the wall's gonna... Um, oh, probably... Right to left. You're here. You'll make sure I don't miss a guide notification. There was a hot dog. You are the guide. You died. Uh oh. So now we can just guarantee whatever emblem we want. I think we've sufficiently proved we could defeat the Wall of Flush. <laughs> Although I did use buffs that uh, I don't know if I actually have the materials to get more of. Whatever, not important. Oh yeah, I should make more iron skin at some point. Effectively trashing these. I don't expect to actually finish research. I still have these knives on me 
don't think they're gonna be too useful at this point in the game. Oh, also, probably don't need to carry around a shadow key. Oh yeah, the part where I actually uh, open some wall of flesh treasure bags. <laughs> Where, okay, got the whip. Oh, it, do, it doesn't have whip in the name, but it has fire in the name. Okay. Ranger emblem. Oh, I'm getting gold from this. Um, I just quick stacked, right? Oh, so that was three. I have opened three bags. So that gold, I'm gonna declare legal anyway. So I quick stacked away emblems. They would have gone somewhere. Yeah, because there was already a warrior emblem in here. Anyway, we haven't gotten a summoner emblem yet. There it is. Mana Sing, even. None of these firecracker whips got a modifier. Technically allowed to use that laser rifle. But I think I would just always prefer the poison staff over it. Alright, let's maybe get a firecracker reforged. Nimble? Murderous? I mean, I'm mostly looking for size, right? <laughs> That's the opposite of what I want. I don't know if I want to accept the minus damage as well. Large. Yeah, that'll do. Platforms. Oh, I spent the money. Whatever. I'm not kind of worried. I only opened one extra treasure bag. I don't know. Actually, let's toss out like five gold? Six? I think that's about how much you get per treasure bag from Wall of Flesh. Bulky is good? No. Well, I got large. Okay, so... Need that anvil still for the wings. I don't have a proper shaft anywhere. I think I'll wait on the Splunker Potion until I've taken one pass through and just gotten the obvious medals. Should have just actually gotten on the rail. Don't know how many more glowing mushrooms I need, but I got some. Minimap? Oh no, that's crimson. You say, is my minimap showing me more palladium? It was not. There's like some mithril up here.
Maybe I should have just started with the Splunker Potion. Seeing a little less exposed Palladium than I expected. Hey, money. Finding some Mithril, though. normal path downward. It apparently doesn't go in the direction of the rail. Or I guess it does, but not in the normal downward direction of the rail. Here's more. No, I thought I had finished digging that block. Okay. Whips better than shooting my poison staff. I just forgot I had it. I should swap their numbers and favorite that. Is that? That's more. Grab the crystals too. Those are mine. Uh, yeah, okay. I keep thinking palladium might be copper. Crystal shard. Couldn't run away from that bat. Traveling merchant, huh? Thank you. 
Ow. Alright. Up there, because of course. Why would anything in the locations of my NPCs make any sense? This is gonna make it, is it? <laughs> Dying. <laughs> well, let's rope up, I guess. Did the harpy despawn, but its projectiles didn't? Oh wait, that's the... I talked to the wizard. have a stopwatch. I think I'm not interested in any of his inventory. Guess I might as well see if I have enough palladium. Pikes and picks are different things. Okay, right. not quite enough. Just go up from here. There's some immediate adamantite, if I could get it. Wait, is that... I think that's more... Palladium. And on our way here, we got some progress towards the century. I guess there was a button there. Eighteen or I probably have enough now. Yeah, the pickaxe. Three bars left over. Hmm, I sure have thrown a lot of things in there. For it being the metals chest. Alright. Well, that's real time.
then I think I only need enough adamantite for the um the forge. Don't think I'm gonna try for any actual adamantite equipment until I've at least like attempted bosses with this summoner setup. If we could skip straight to hallowed, that would be neat. Oh wait. To the right was the actual path. some sapphires while we're here. I believe there was more mithril to the left here. still don't have grand design. I keep just not bothering to put it together. Hello. And goodbye. I think this is four per bar. So it's seven bars. I think the anvil requires eight. Hey, armor polish. more mithril on the way down somewhere. Can at least check for more easy crystals while we're here. Ow! The snipe. in a moment. Alright, 
could probably head back and get my wings now. Hey, a trifold map. Hey, uh, why am I in the mushroom biome in hard mode at all? Um... It's adamantite. More adamantite. Trap that I'm acknowledging way late. Palladium, it looks like. Oh, that's a heart statue. Um, yeah. Destroyed by just a regular bat. It's just a chest. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> Maybe a little something more than just a chest. But it's not a mimic. torches. And apparently the thing I decided I should duplicate is wood and not torches. Should probably just research torches too. But that might be the last stack of torches I need in the game. Oh wait, no, I didn't make a full stack. I made 147. Yeah, we're gonna want more torches at some point. Anyway, let's... Head back and see if we have an anvil. Okay, I did already have a stopwatch. 
Also, I apparently never got an aglet, but I have the anklet of the wind. I always find it weird you can't block or place an anvil with another anvil. Yeah, I don't quite have enough for a pick. Wait, this is the Platinum World. I quick stacked my torches somewhere. Didn't realize I even had torches in a chest. All right, uh, so. I think it's time for a Splunker Potion. Gave it a good look around without it. I think I could have spotted that without the potion. Did Team Cats win? Yes. It was a glorious day. Am I getting any more ores? Because I don't have the pickaxe yet. Also, yeah, I forgot the wings. I need pick to get the adamantite forge. Because I figure I'll eventually need it for chlorophyte, right? Just getting it while I'm... already doing mining. Okay, yeah, if I'm just going for the forge, there's like plenty of adamantite around here. It's just finishing the mithril. Palladium vein if I'd just come from bottom up. Now maybe I should be going down to the underworld. Oh, there's Mr. the Skeleton. I don't know if I want any of his stuff. Maybe I should make the yo-yo thing. There might be some good yo-yos I'm allowed to use. But I don't think, yeah, Yelitz has no I in it. I have Cthulhu yo-yo, only has an EYE in it. That's not the right kind of I. I think. Is it just called Eye of Cthulhu? Or is there like another word in there? Possibly yo-yo. <laughs> I guess maybe I could be skipping the mithril pick, come to think of it. Because I could get the adamantite with the hallowed pick. But I think here's enough mithril. So yeah, you you were right to call out the fact that I was getting more ore. I 
I'm just too used to thinking of things in the usual order. I guess if I do abandon the summoning plan, because maybe I can't beat any bosses with this, I need to move a little more to the left. souls with me right now. That's not the... Yeah. Alright, well I have Splunker going. I am gonna try to grab 30 out of Mantidor. Oh wait, it only has 30 seconds on it. I don't know if I can get one ore per second. But it'll at least let me get that. mining it with the lava there. I was gonna say I should at least finish mining it. Wait, it goes back on the... yeah. Okay, so that's our mining adventures done. I guess I mined one extra. Okay, so need more pixie dust to make better potions, or I could fight mimics. I think one of those is easier than the other. What boss do you summon with just souls of light? And, you know, the non-soul materials. Is it the eye? Twins? Okay. Oh yeah, I guess there are two of them. <laughs> the eyes. I think Summoner might want to fight those first. I don't have the piercing to fight Destroyer, really. I, I, I. See, actually, uh. Do the twins give the right soul for the Oculus staff? It would make sense if they did. Oh, wait, but I. There's no eye in it. This isn't a summoner playthrough. Another rainbow slime? I'm fighting like as many rainbow slimes as pixies. <laughs> or ocular staff, not oculus staff, but still there's no eye. I know, we might be getting hallowed bars and then like immediately pivoting away from summoner. Probably want to get at least, like, 20 pixie dust. Might be able to get 30 potions if, uh, you know, RNG cooperates. Know, maybe I just farm all the way to 30 dust. Party girl. Fifty. 
felt like a windy sandstorm. Twenty six, that's probably fine. Cool whip possibilities of ice golem? Oh yeah. That's probably more valuable than going to the desert. I had some thoughts of Spirit Flame, but we're so far from putting a mage build together right now. Just I don't think I've ever used Spirit Flame. So it might have been neat. I know, getting Forbidden Fragments just feels like it always is going to take longer than it's worth. Unless your weather events just, like, come right away. Not sure if enough weather. Okay. Well, Firecracker's probably fine. Nimbus Rod would be neat. I was trying to get Nimbus Rod at the start of the stream because it happened to be raining, but... The Nimbus enemies were taking a while to actually kill, and I was like, we could get the spider stuff so much more easily. A bit less RNG. <laughs> Thought I had more crystal shards than that. Not gonna lie. I quick stacked the pixie dust somehow? Oh yeah, there was just a little in there. Wait, what am I missing now? I thought it was... Oh wait, no, you make them from water. You don't make them from the previous potion. Only half the potions in the game are made from the previous potion. Quite the typo on bottle, yeah. Uh, you don't drop things in the duplication menu to research them, by the way. <laughs> the last normal healing potion drink. Alright, yeah, this can all just go in here, I guess. Okay, so besides the actual summon... And maybe Arena. I don't know if I want to fight the twins on this. Um, I might want to wire up that heart statue. Where did it go? I put it like probably... no. I am a fool. Why do I have an angel statue? There it is. Yeah, let's actually, like, get our grand design. That might be a good thing to do. And then, like, some addi additional wire and, like, a timer. I think grand design is somewhere around, like, 50 wire. You need the lens, but need the ruler from you. Oh, I got the exact amount of wire, but I need more wire. And I didn't actually get the timer. I mean, why not just a one-second timer? A lot of the time it won't actually be able to trigger the statue, but I think it's on like a 12-second cooldown. I guess the three-second timer would also hit it exactly every 12. Okay, so it's not sandstorming, so yeah, the... Alright, 
that's making hearts. Um... Oh yeah, I can fly a lot higher now. <laughs> there are no heart lanterns around here, really. I didn't have that many life crystals when I fought the Eye of Cthulhu, and I think that's all this arena's been used for so far. Some of those might be neat. So some chains. Heart lanterns. Oh, wow. I didn't realize how many chains those took. Research the souls. <laughs> and then just make three of this. Research that too. No, oh, I could also have researched lenses. Oh, right, that's the soul of night. be the last time I ever use lenses. Oh, unless I make archery potions. Why am I running to the desert this time? I guess it's not that far. Oop. I was not above the block. Each campfire seems to be a decent spot for them. I guess I put the campfires in decent spots. Actually, let's just keep these with us. Oh yeah, buffing potions. Iron skin would be neat. Okay, I do have Ledoer over here. Let's just get Iron Skin researched. So I don't have to worry about running out of lead ore. Takes like 20. Yeah. Still the wrong part of the menu. Honestly, yeah, it is time to have the basic buffs just researched. Oh, I might not have enough. Actually, wait. I don't even have the fish for endurance. Yeah, let's get regen taken care of as well. And then one in the piggy bank. No, two in the piggy bank. All right, I guess those are our basic buffs for now then. Uh, getting a well-fed might be good, too. What kind of well-fed? I mean, seafood dinner is an obvious choice. Let's see, I probably, like, researched a fishing rod of some kind. I guess they're all called poles, not rods. Yeah. Stuck it in a chest somewhere then. 
Ah, oh, there. Fiberglass. Nightcrawler. Oh, flesh catcher. Was that in there? Fish down there, I guess? Probably enough water. Oh, and I could combine it. I mean, fine. We'll try the auto-summoned boss. Oh, hi, Skeletron. Yeah. Not sure I'm ready for this one. But it's fun to see. Poison Staff not bad on him? Okay. I feel like if you're gonna use Poison Staff, you probably want the rest of the Mage build to go with it. No, I have probably time to hit these buffs. Make sure all my spiders are summoned. Actually, I want to see which direction he's coming from. Background walls would have been neat. But yeah, the spiders can jump. They can jump pretty well. Hey, Judge. Oh, hi. I didn't see him on the map at all before I saw him. Fast. Oh yeah, I have... I didn't get lightning boots. Okay. So mobility is more of an issue. More like I'm super slow, yeah. Yeah, these are just specter boots. That shield of Cthulhu and pygmy necklace both need reforged. I think we can do better than one defense at this point. Yeah, like 4% damage. Aglet probably easy if I splunk across the surface? Maybe. I'll try it. I'm willing to give it a go. We do have like six splunker potions without even needing to make more. I don't know if I've ever splunked across the surface before. Didn't know there could be such big ore veins near it. It's probably just two ore veins that spawned next to each other. Oh, I don't have the net on my bar. Because I was going to go fishing, right? Game does breadcrumbs well. Alright. Oh, I don't have any summons out, because I died. Some pots down there. 
Not quite what we're into. Let's see, trying to think of what I do if I can't find an aglet. Quite what we're looking for, but fun to check. Guess I'm wasting Splunker duration, but. Enchanted Sword! Forget how Arcalis is obtained these days? I mean, I think that shrine could have been one. It just happens to roll Enchanted Sword. they changed it? Oh, okay. They could have. Now that they can drop Terragram, and you know, Arcalis is part of a dev set expert bag drop. Okay. explore a little deeper than just running across the surface to find the remaining surface chests. <laughs> Gotta drink another... Kind of seems high elevation, maybe? Yeah. Alright. Didn't get it here. That turtle almost murdered me. Near the surface, everything's dirt. Maybe I just like dig down a little and then start shoveling horizontally with the splunker going. I 
I guess actually there are like ores and things. Okay, but just running to the cave over here. Try it like this elevation. I should put these next to each other. You'd go lower? Okay. I already saw that. Oh, yeah. Do I have a mining potion? I have two. sense. Let's maybe not try to dig out the entire desert. Can just skip to the other side of it sometime. Oh no, my torch. What do I do if I don't find an aglet? I could just wear the anklet of the wind over maybe the obsidian shield. That would help some. Could try reforging things to speed boosting modifiers. Suffer? Yeah, that's an option. Swiftness potions, yeah. For the rest of the game, for every boss. Better wings, yeah. Don't know what better wings are possible right now. I guess if I actually farmed for the harpy wings, do those have higher stats? Or might be possible to get the various, like, jungle rare enemy wings. Just gonna peek up there in case I didn't actually see everything around there. Oh yeah, void bag. Also, my splunker wore out. You think moth butterfly is post something? Okay. I'd believe that. They feel post something. that light's coming from. Oh, an altar. Okay. Sure. Yeah, 
There's a chest. Aglet is 1 in 12, apparently. Okay. Fun. Found four so far? I mean, I've also found other surface chests in the game, but yeah, four today sounds about right. This is all dirt. I'm a bit higher since I went up to get that chest. And also, this part of the world just is even higher. More important that we just keep seeing things that haven't been seen than staying at a consistent elevation. I might want to go down a bit more actually now. curious if there was like a dead man's I don't know if there can be like wooden dead man's chests The fact that it's pixies rather than al other hallow enemies at least shows that I'm close enough to the surface that the chests would be surface chests if I see one still. Ah, the slow effect from the ice biome. I think if I run out of the Splunker potions already in my piggy bank, we put Blizzard back on. Rely on jumps for acceleration. No. Oh. Uh, yeah. chest is at least a little fun. I think I might be too deep. Flipper fight Skeletron in the ocean. <laughs> I mean, don't see what could possibly go wrong with that. We'll just keep swinging a breathing reed at him so that we don't run out of air, because we'll have the breathing reed equipped.
Or, you know, water breathing potion. Too low right now? Okay. Now okay? Okay. The music changed. Oh, the mining potion wore out. I think there is another mining potion in the piggy bank. Yes, one. changed again. Oh, it's the dungeon. It's a water chest. So I guess maybe if I went down a bit, I could not be in the dungeon? Yeah, that seems way better than just cutting horizontally through everything. I already have an inner tube. went down that sword shrine with Splunker active. I'm just gonna go around to it rather than mining all the way through. Go down to like here-ish. surface chest. Come on, big money. No whammies. Wand of sparking. <laughs> Yahtzee. Sparking hype. Skeletron's got no chance now. I'm probably a bit high, probably already checked this area. That's not the shovel. I'm 
actually, this is all dirt for a bit. I mouse wheeled the wrong way. Guess there's a cloud there now. want to peek down here. Looks like there's a bit of a tunnel. Okay, but surely this is too deep now. Sand, huh? Wait. No, I think that's just ore of some kind. Don't want to try digging through a whole desert. forest starts like here probably a good distance down to enemies. Oh, well, we died to enemies. <coughs> I had three gold. Let's get back out there and at least look in that chest. Maybe get the gold back. I expect traveling along the surface will take much less time than Digging through the entire world. Man, glad I at least got that mithril pick. <laughs> right. Not time to go down yet. Well, I guess I don't know if mithril actually digs through stone any faster than palladium. Is the title of the video gonna be Queen Bee? Nah, it'll probably just be like early hard mode. I usually name the video for the- Oh, hey! <laughs> for the progression, not just for the boss. Yay! <laughs> it's been done. Maybe summon a spider or ten? Oh yeah, that would help fight enemies. I don't even know what my minion count is.
Oh yeah, I don't have boots right now. I was like, why was I going so slow? Arcane, I think we can do better than that. Precise? Spiked? Spiked again? Spiked again? What? Fine, I'm out of money. <laughs> so apparently you can get the same modifier three times in a row. Oh yeah, I got fairies. I guess you can probably like release them underground and they'll actually like show you something. Good racket that goblin runs? Yeah. I feel like if I pay for a reforge, he should at least reforge it and not just pass it back to me. Be like, hey, I totally reforged this. Reminds you of the joke. What joke? Where a guy says someone broke into his house last night and stole all his stuff. Wow, I feel so fast. And replaced it with exact replicas, yeah. Oh yeah, I watered. I feel when you water. Alright, so we got a little distracted on account of a boss summoning itself, which I think I'm like legally obligated to try since it's not hardcore. But it was fishing time, so we could actually get a well-fed buff. Actually, does well-fed increase your movement speed? That might have been part of the problem too. Like, like what stats doesn't well-fed do, right? Yes? Okay. Just trying to make sure all the water here counts as water. It does feel like enough water if I do this, though. Probably don't even need to bother fixing that up over there. Uh, might want to block off the area so enemies don't get in. just becomes cooked fish. We need, like, something else. Oh, yeah, endurance potions would also be neat. You know, while we're here. Oh. Uh, I guess the quest is here? See what 
It's 6 a.m. I wonder if the quest just changed. Uh, apparently not. Then get it back out so I stop catching them. Specular fish. I think those become seafood dinner. So I need like one more specular fish and one more, uh, no more armored cave fish. gonna check at the cooking pot first. Oh, you can also make them out of armored cave fish. I always forget the potion ingredient fish are still fish. Yeah, let's open the crates. Iron skin, money, bait, titanium ore. That was a good session of fishing. I guess I could have just gotten armored cave fish out. <laughs> uh, oh, I don't have enough blinker, do I? Bit of a flaw in my whole plan to research the endurance potions, huh? Unless I'm very lucky with the alchemy station. Huh. Let's get that fishing quest turned in before the time changes. Oh, wait, I have a... Magic conch. You don't happen to be selling the pylon. Actually, wait, yeah, does that? It doesn't quick stack, okay. There must not be another one in there. Let's at least make what endurance potions I can. Let's see, bottles. I should harvest Daybloom. Well, I should harvest whatever's ready to harvest. And then plant. Blank root seeds, if I have any. I do. Oh, you don't need Daybloom for endurance potions. Oh, well, we got nine. I think I saved one blank root with the alchemy station. can at least start using them. Don't need a potion research to be allowed to use it. We'll eventually get more blink root. We already have infinite armored cave fish and bottled water. I'm gonna put this in here though. Also this goes over here. 
Right. This also goes in there. Well, without pivoting away from Summoner, I think I'm as ready as I'm gonna get for the twins. summon my things. Yes, they appear to be on spasmatism. Ow. I can't tell if the whip's reaching there. Core flasks. That's another buff we can use if we're using a whip. Hard to get between the cursed flames with a good timing. I guess doing it while moving away makes the timing easier. I've been so focused on evading, I haven't even been remembering to swing the whip. Transform. Ah, thought it was gonna stop spitting the flames earlier than that. I think the flames only last like three seconds. <laughs> Alright. Uh, that might have been winnable. Maybe if I had some background walls around. I feel like the spiders weren't actually hitting as much as I would have wanted them to. Do I have any background walls duplicated? Or researched? Yeah, wooden walls. Of course, let's get the spiders back out. Before actually trying the boss again, I'll of course actually want to buff with the bewitching table. I think I neglected that last time. Might builder potion would help a lot. Oh yeah, wonder if I happen to have one. Exactly one. For the actual fight, Summoning Potion is a buff that I didn't have available to me. Or maybe there was one in the piggy bank. I should check. Might be nice.
Where are my spiders? Yeah, I guess in terms of the boss health bar, it didn't look like that close. But if we'd taken down Spasmatism, the fight would have been like over. And it sure is gonna take a while to place all the walls I want. I'm doing the bottom first, but we want this to be kind of tall. I don't know, maybe I'm not gonna fight horizontally in this whole arena. Maybe we start going up a bit. Also, I guess once the spiders latch on, we could go into the other part of the arena. And they'd just be latched on. I guess if I didn't have wood duplicated, I'd just be using dirt walls here. I don't think journey mode is actually changing the way I'm approaching this fight, is what I'm trying to imply. Hello, wood walls. Hey, Alan. Just giving our spiders more area to walk on. You're back for the last few minutes. Well, there should be another attempt at the twins. Even if we go a little past noon, I'm gonna attempt the twins again. You're disappointed at the lack of hay walls. I never bought a sickle. You are easily disappointed. This is true, yes. And easily delighted. Hmm. Oh, the stack wore out. Wore out? Ran out? <laughs> you just like your walls made from hay? Man, imagine if NPCs actually had preferences for what their houses were made of. Yes, that is your only quirk. I see the, yeah, the use of the word just does imply that, doesn't it? Also like Flamingo. Yeah, they could have gone a lot deeper into NPC happiness. But I guess they decided they wanted the placement of NPCs to be the most important thing. Did impromptu wall of flesh and died? Yeah, I did. Then did tiny potion prep and won three times. Sounds right. Turns out water walking and obsidian skin are helpful.
Yeah, this was the world of not building a wall of flesh arena. Right, I think when this stack runs out, I'm gonna declare this wooden wall to be tall enough. Although I guess if I die, I don't have another builder potion. I probably have the materials for one, right? I just don't know what builder potions are made of because I never have crafted one, like ever. Well, I've probably done so before, but I don't remember it. Yeah, then I searched for a whole world after an aglet, after a Skeletron that auto-summoned itself destroyed me. Because I was like, oh yeah, Skeletron's just kind of like running me over. Might need more movement speed. This <laughs> stream should be titled Searching of a Hive and an Aglet. I mean, yeah, kinda. <laughs> he also joked the title Queen Bee. You support that? I, yeah, I did get wings in Mithril Anvil. And the entire, like, spider set. Uh, except the sentry. What if I actually went and got the sentry before we attempted this fight again? I wonder if just well getting the, uh, metals... Did I get enough spider fangs? <laughs> Uh, no. Alright, let's... let's get that. Dying to Illuminant Bats is a clear sign we're ready for the twins, right? I guess I don't know how many of these I need. <laughs> it's probably like 18, right? That sounds like a number. 18 or 24. Search Souls of Light. I don't need to care about the soul drop. I'll just go to 24 while we're here. That's the only material. I was like, okay, what else is it time to get out? Nothing. I don't think the Crimson Rod's gonna be doing much in hard mode. Probably done with fangs, don't need to keep putting them in the uh you know, the material chest that I keep putting them in. I guess I researched blue slime banners for some reason. Oh, that's already... Okay. Reforged Sentry? Oh, yeah. Probably have enough for, like, one Reforge. Would most likely be better than no modifier. Annoying. Huh, just kidding. Keen? I don't think it can crit. Weak. Well... Whatever. Knockback, not gonna matter against the boss. Uh, did I? 
I don't know if I touched the buffs. All right, so nighttime buff summon. Oh yeah, make sure I actually have the spiders out. I don't want Retinazer to be the one that's whipped. Ow. 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 <laughs> this may not be the run. I'm willing to give it another try after this one, though. I played really badly at the start. So where's the heart statue? Oh, it's outside of where I thought I'd be doing most of the fighting. <laughs> yes, the ow 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 strategy. Oh wait, I got a dodge from something. Wait, what would be giving me dodges? Oh, probably brain? Yeah, it's a Crimson World. That would be my defensive evil biome accessory. I seem to be at max health again. Uh, just kidding. Oh. Uh, huh. Ow. Couldn't get out of the flames. One more try. And then that'll be the stream either way. So I think... Okay, let's actually make sure we start with all the spiders summoned. Um, also... Uh, swiftness? Speed seems to be important in this fight too. It's not just Skeletron that can chase you down. Yeah, I have the wrong one whipped right now. Trying to move less horizontally so the spiders can actually stay latched a bit better. Oh yeah, I still haven't gone and gotten a flask.
spiders still exist. That's good. Maybe I should just be trying to summon them directly on him. I don't know. Okay, so while he's doing the flames, he's slow enough that if the spiders are nearby, we do get some damage in. You think I need the poison staff to stay out of range? Yeah, that might be working better than what I've been trying. died. Bring him back over here where we've actually got the walls. Eh? Oh, there's a summon. Or no, is that just a normal enemy? I don't think that's related to the boss. zombie there. I think as long as I'm just fighting the boss, I'm pretty likely to win <laughs> from this point. Yeah, time of day is looking fine. Potion cooldown is 20 seconds. Could have whacked him. Oh no. No. <laughs> ah, close. All right. Recycled, yeah. Next time we'll get a bit more prepared. We'll have we'll get summoning potion. I think is possible at this stage in the game. Um, what else would help? Flask, yeah, Icor. Oh yeah, I haven't farmed Souls of Night at all. I was like, wait a minute, why don't I already have Icor? I'll at least get the. Oh. I don't have money. <laughs> I was gonna say, I'll at least get the imbuing station now. I should probably, like, just make more stained glass. It should be able to- wait, that's not the plant's chest. I think I have plenty of this stuff that makes stained glass, just need to actually do it. So yeah, that'll be the plan. Thanks for watching. See ya.